welcome to my channel today i am doing another grocery haul um before i get started on showing you guys what all we purchased at walmart today um if you guys have not subscribed go ahead and do so click the subscribe button hit the bell um i will show you guys what all we picked up and then i will show y'all my calendar y'all i'm trying to make the best of my groceries we spend a good maybe around six something for groceries um today i spent 370 i'm telling you when i tell y'all every day i'm at walmart i'm at walmart every day so that 370 easily go up sometimes i forget stuff um i did write down stuff that i did forget on my calendar so i have to go back and pick that up so that can easily go up to a good six something and, and we're there every day so let me show y'all what i picked up okay you guys so here is everything laid out okay this is what 370 got us at walmart so let us start on this end and then we'll work our way down to that end okay so first we have two things of bacon that's not gonna last um a month um but i ended up getting two i have some ribs underneath it i have steak let me move this out of the way hopefully that'll okay oh my fruit i have or some of the fruit i have um bananas and grapefruit banana and grapefruit then back over here i have don't mind my fat fingers i put <laughs> my hands look like the hamburger helper gloves but that's okay over here i have um two packages of the sausage links tray actually ate these so i got two of those um chicken thighs which I may, no, I'm not going to cook these tonight. Um, I have boneless, skinless chicken thighs. I have two packs. I have my two loaves of bread and a big old thing of ground meat. I have utensils, which I'm glad we got because we ran out. Everybody over here using spoons, but I did get um, some more this here is not gonna last a month um i meant to get a box but i got a bag and i got the wrong one i put they like the black bag but they have purple now so they have chips for um for their lunches then right here i have boneless skinless chicken breast i have a package of chicken wings drumsticks and then chicken thighs. I believe this is bone in. If he's bone in, yeah, bone in. Um, skin on chicken thighs. Which will, I'm gonna cook this tonight for dinner. Ooh, scoot that over. Starting with some veggies. I have broccoli. I got two packages of those. I have green beans. Two packages of those. Um, oh, I got three things of broccoli. Okay, and then I have the California style mixed veggies. I like these. The kids really can care less. Um, they don't like when carrots are soft, so they probably won't eat it. Ty don't like cauliflower. He likes it. He'll eat it, but he does prefer not to. But I eat all of that. We have jasmine rice. I have two family size bag of Doritos, which I forgot to get um, Velveeta cheese for Rotel and stuff. So I have to go back and get that. I have a um, package of chicken fajitas. We have pizza rolls for the kids snacks. For someone, both of my kids, they do not eat these, but again, I do so. I got two of those. 
a thing of milk which i have to go back and get another one because i switched trays milk from um, soy vanilla to almond vanilla so i'm gonna go back and get him some milk um right here i have two sweet potatoes i have a red onion a yellow onion and a tomato y'all i don't know why <laughs> i only got one tomato but i did end up doing the what do you call that the walmart pickup and so you place your order online and then you go and you pick it up when i was putting everything in my cart i thought i put four of these but i guess i only put one so yeah i have some avocado picked up my oils um avocado oil and i have my avocado oil spray cream cheese two of those makes perfect roll-ups for tray i have some butter then i ended up getting this butter cheese for their lunches ham for their lunches which i picked up yesterday because they needed lunch or sandwiches today, so I had to pick up some yesterday. So, Ty love these flaky biscuits. So, I have two of the butter kind and then the honey butter. I have two of those over here. Why did I only get one thing of ragu? I don't know. This is roasted garlic. I have to get another one. I normally get these. Um, they come like this, two in the pack. I don't know if this comes too in the pack. Actually, I don't think it does. I like to get the roasted garlic and then another, like, I don't know, something with vegetables in it. But I got this little old tiny barbecue sauce. I thought it was the big one. I don't know how long that's going to last. Then I have some mustard, some ground mustard, and then I have cream of chicken, Rotel cream of chicken. So basically it's cream of chicken, Rotel cream of mushroom. Why do I have one can of corn? I don't know, but I have it. <laughs> so mushroom, Rotel. That this is for when I do my chicken and dumplings. When I do um, smothered, what do you call that? Pork chops or smothered chicken. I use my cream of mushroom soup. Um, what else did I get? Oh, Rotel for nachos. I have some seasonings, um, the steak seasoning, and I have garlic. I have apples, and then fruit cups, oranges, mixed fruit. I have some spinach. What are these? Peaches, strawberries, grapes. And then snacks, we have nature valley granola bars nutter buddies we have two of these things trey loves these things um so we got two of those and the kids like them too so and then i have to get two of them i got two because they will eat them all and have nothing left for trey so we have one box for trey one box for dj and elena so over here when they come home from school they like to eat sandwiches and chips, which is something that they normally take for lunch. So to eliminate that, so they would have food for lunch, I picked up chicken pot pies. The pizza rolls is for something they can eat when they come home. They have noodles. They have these Marie Calendar cheesy rice. Um, what is this? Uh, cheesy chicken and rice. And then I like the um alfredo broccoli and chicken that's all they have in here no pastas so that's good i have some cocoa puffs uh, let's see what else they have the nutter butter they have um tray and the kids they love um eggos so about two of those i got these here these are so good graham crackers with um peanut butter They'll eat that for a snack. 
um, sausage on a stick and then they have the Oreo Nutter Butter and Cookie Crisp uh, Chips Ahoy my bad <laughs> they have Chips Ahoy um, I bought one yesterday so now they have two of those and then what else we have over here we have syrup and then we have a big old thing of juice for their lunch and then these are a good substitute for sodas for me. They have zero sugar, zero calories, zero caffeine, zero sodium. I have cherry lime And then I have the pineapple coconut and then a wild cherry. Um, we have two things of bowls and a big old thing of uh, plates. The only thing that I am missing from this is something for them to pop in the microwave as far as um what do you call those sausage i normally get the little sausage patties so they can have sausage and eggos um i forgot to get trays some milk and then what else did i forget i have my fruits i have my veggies and then i have oh there was something else that i forgot I have to type it up here that I need to pick up from the store dog food. I need to get dog food. But yeah, y'all, this is pretty much it. I am about to show you guys how I am going to attempt <laughs> to make this last a month. I know it's not going to last a month, but I need to make use of all of this stuff. So I will show y'all my calendar and my meals that I plan on making from here on out so let me grab my calendar and I will show y'all how I'm going to use all of this. Oh, I forgot to show y'all this. I got sandwich bags and then gallon bags for, let me make sure these are freezer. Okay, yeah, I have um, freezer bags for my chicken. I do not want to throw this big old thing in the freezer because when I thaw it out, I have to unthaw the whole thing. So I like to break it up and put um, so many in a pack. That way, when I thaw it out, we use the whole thing instead of having to, you know, unthaw the whole thing and have to cook all of it and end up wasting it. So, yeah, let me go ahead and grab my calendar. Okay, you guys. So here is um, my calendar. I do my grocery shopping around the 22nd, 23rd, 24th ish. Um, today we did it on the 22nd. So I started um, doing my meal prep or, or for dinner. Um, I started writing it on this calendar. We have um, just ideas so I know what to pick up from the store. So um, we may not eat these. Uh, are these meals on this exact day but they're meal ideal so if I don't know what to eat I go to the calendar see uh, what we haven't eaten yet and then I'll go from there but on the 25th is my birthday so I will not be doing anything over the weekend especially on my birthday and Saturday on Sunday um, I do plan on cooking because Monday the kids go to school and sometimes Trey take whatever is left over from dinner he'll take it for lunch tomorrow so i'll be cooking on saturday or on friday not friday what am i doing we'll be cooking on sunday and then um the ones that has like the little arrows i make enough to do two days so spaghetti should be two days so um Chicken and shrimp alfredo will be two days. And then chicken and dumplings is like two days. So I do try to make meals that can last two days. Or I do simple meals like fish, rice, and corn. Or what is this? Uh, I put CT with green beans, mashed potatoes. I don't even know what CT stands for anymore. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what CT is uh yeah i don't even remember what ct stands for anymore so i probably just have to start writing out everything because i just don't remember what the heck ct with green beans and mashed potatoes 
I don't know. But anyway, so this is it. And then on this side, I write down everything that I need to pick up from the store. <laughs> There's something I want Put money in time